Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about how to find the slant height with a base of 10 and a height of 12. Now, a slant height is generally known as the hypotenuse, or it can be thought of, the, uh, thought of as the hypotenuse because of its diagonal length. Now, when you have a base of 10, you're talking about the horizontal length and a height, the vertical length, of 12 not drawn to scale, obviously. What you can do is use the tried and true method of the Pythagorean theorem to help you. And we're gonna label the slant height h, and we'll just kind of go from there. So if you remember the formula for the Pythagorean theorem, a squared plus b squared is equal to c squared, the idea here is that a and b are your legs, and that makes the 10 and 12 your legs, and then we're gonna find um, the c, which is h. So you have 10 squared plus 12 squared is equal to h squared. So you have 10 squared is 100, 12 squared is 144, and that's equal to h squared. So 100 plus 40, 144 is 244, and that's equal to h squared. And where you want to go from there is take the square root of both sides. So you have h is equal to, now you generally take pl the plus or minus values when it comes to taking the square root, but since we're talking about an actual height, we are going to go with a positive value. So h is the square root of 244. Now. If you want to break it down, you can divide 4 into 244 because 4 is a perfect square. 4 goes into 24 six times, 4 goes into 4 one time, so this can be thought of as square root of 4 times square root of 61, or 2 square root of 61, and that is your slant height. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that addresses how to find the slant height of the, with the base 10 and a height of 12.